Here's a iPad Pro third generation. I'm going to show you how to set it up step by step. So first thing, after you turn it on, you're going to see hello in English and different languages and whatnot. First thing is from the bottom here, you just want to swipe up like this. Now from here, you want to go ahead and choose your language. I'm going to go with English here. Go ahead and choose your uh, country or region. I'm in the United States here, so I'm going to tap on US right there. Now it says here you can do a quick start. It says bring your current iPhone or iPad near this iPad to sign in and set up. So if you want to bring your iPhone or iPad near this one, you can set it up a little bit quicker, okay? For me, I'm just going to do everything manually, okay? So I'm going to tap on set up manually right here. I'm going to go ahead and choose my Wi-Fi network, which is right here. I'm going to go ahead and input my password. After you put in your password, you can tap on join down there or down here, it doesn't matter. Give it one second here. Okay, now it says here, this will take a few minutes to activate your iPad, so be patient here. Data and privacy, you can redo that. You can tap to learn more if you wanna learn more about it. After that, go ahead and tap on continue right here. Now here's the face ID, basically your face ID password. If you, if you don't wanna use this, you can go ahead and tap on set up later and settings, and then you can also set it up later if you wish. For me, I'm gonna go ahead and set this up now. So I'm gonna tap on continue right there. And then we're going to tap on Get Started. All right, now I'm going to position my face right in here and just wait until the circle goes all the, the green goes all the way around. So just wait here. Mine's taking a little bit longer because I got this camera like in the way. So here's the face ID, it's the face ID password. We can set this up now, or you can go ahead and tap down here to set up later in settings, or you don't have to set it up. You don't want to set it up, just tap on set up later in settings, okay? For me, I'm going to go ahead and do this right now. It only takes a second. I'm going to tap on continue here. Then I'm going to tap on get started. And now what I'm going to do is put my face in that square. And what I'm going to do is go around like this. Move my head in a 360 degrees, just like that. Voila, we're done. Okay, go ahead and tap on continue right there. Oh, it's asking me to do it again. Let me do it again. And let me just go around like this all the way up. Okay, face ID is now set up. Face ID password, so I'm going to go tap on continue now. Now I'm going to go ahead and create a passcode here. So with this passcode, you'll be able to um, log in using your face ID, or if not, you can use your passcode. So go ahead and make a passcode for yourself. After you do it the first time, it's gonna ask you a second time to reconfirm, okay? All right, there we go. And I'll give it one second here. Apps and data. Choose how you want to transfer apps and data to this iPad, okay? So you can go ahead and if, if you can restore from a iCloud backup, you can restore from a Mac or a PC with iTunes, or you can transfer directly from another iPad, or you can move data from an Android tablet or phone, or you can don't transfer apps and data. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have a clean slate here, so I'm gonna go ahead and tap on this very bottom here. Go ahead and enter your Apple ID, uh, email, and then password. If you wanna do this later, you can do it as well. I'm gonna do it later. So I'm gonna tap down here, forgot password, or don't have an Apple ID. So I'm just gonna tap down here. I'm just gonna skip this for now. And I'm going to tap on Setup Later in Settings. I'm doing that because I can't remember my password to my Apple ID. So I'm going to go ahead and tap on, Are you sure you don't want to use Apple ID? And I'm going to put on Don't Use for now. And again, what I'll do is I'll set it up later. From here, Terms and Condition, you must agree to proceed, okay? So I'm going to tap on Agree right there. Express Settings, you can customize settings or you can just continue from here. For me, I'm good with just going with Continue here. Keep your iPad up to date. I'm going to tap on continue. And here we can go ahead and set up Siri or you can click down here, set up later in settings. Or if you don't want to set it up, you can also just click down here, set up later in settings. For me, I'm going to go ahead and set this up Siri now. I'm going to tap on continue. I'm going to pick my voice that I want. So I just got to pick hi, one. I'm, hi, I'm, hi, I'm okay, so I'm hi, good with this I'm one here. Siri, now I'm going to click on like next. You can change it. Hey Siri, you gotta read this. 
Hey Siri, send a message. Hey Siri, how's the weather today? Hey Siri, set a timer for three minutes. Hey Siri, play some music. Okay, and now I'm going to tap on continue down here. And you can go ahead and share audio recordings or you can do not now. It's up to you. It's a preference. Okay, I'm fine with go ahead and I'm um, sharing. Screen time, get, get weekly reports with insights about your screen time and set time limits for apps you want to manage. Uh, if you want to do that, go ahead and tap on continue. I, I'm, I don't care for the screen time, so I'm just going to click on set up later in settings and never set it up. App, analyt app analytics, you can go ahead and share with app developers or you don't have to share, okay? It's a preference, it doesn't matter, okay? I'm fine with going and sharing with them. True tone display, you can go without it or you can go ahead and use it. I would recommend just go ahead and use the true tone display. Tap on continue down here. Appearance, do you want light or do you want dark mode? Okay, most of you guys will go with the dark mode. I like the dark mode as well. I'm gonna tap on continue. Welcome to iPad, tap on get started. And voila. So there you go. Hey Siri, what's the weather today? It's currently clear and 64 degrees. Temperatures well, will be fairly consistent. There you guys Averaging go. Now you can go ahead and uh, if you have a uh, one that has a um, cellular model with the uh, SIM card, you can put that in there as well. Okay? Good luck, guys.